A pioneering new treatment is harnessing the power of papaya and pineapple to avoid skin grafts and burns victims. The specialist unit in Livingston is the first in Scotland to use the treatment, which reduces the need for surgery involving general anaesthetic. The application helps to preserve healthy tissue and has so far encouraged swift recovery times. Well, Kay Nicholson's been speaking to one of the first patients to benefit. Leanne Jones took these pictures on what should have been a fun day out in July. She and her family had just enjoyed a breakfast barbecue at the beach before the day took an unexpected turn. The little disposable barbecue was still really hot, so as things were starting to get a bit busier, I decided to, to move it. And then I got distracted and I accidentally stood in some sand where um, the barbecue had been sat. And that caused a severe burn to the top of her left foot. Just a few days later, Leanne was given a new treatment from her hospital bed. A paste of papaya and pineapple enzymes was applied to dissolve the burnt skin while protecting any healthy tissue. The first thing that springs to mind is this, but the enzymes aren't actually taken from the pineapple fruit, they're taken from the tree. This burns unit in Livingston is currently the only hospital in Scotland using this pioneering treatment, but there have been various benefits so far. The standard for treatment for that is to cut away the dead surface skin and usually put a skin graft on it. The trouble with feet and hands is that there isn't very much spare tissue there. Now, it won't always um, prevent the need for a, a skin graft, because if, if the burn is deep enough, you may still need to skin graft it afterwards. But certainly, in a lot of burns, certainly the, the more minor ones, you're avoiding a, a general anaesthetic, which can only be a good thing. These pictures show the clear progress made since the four-hour treatment. Leanne healed so quickly she was back working as a beauty therapist just three weeks later. She's also back driving again. As an alternative to the skin graft, it was, it was significant for me. Um, I dread to think how long it would have taken me to get back on my feet and get back to normal family life, which was, which was most important to me. So for me, it was like, I have to say it was life changing. Nexobrid is only licensed for burns at the moment, but this groundbreaking new treatment is being considered for other uses in the future. Kay Nicholson, STV News, Livingston.